It's now 8.30 a.m. We didn't go to bed until like 1. I didn't finish editing yesterday's video until like 1. But I had to get it done because today's going to be absolutely insane. An old coach of ours from Faber, he's opening up his own box in Norwich. So we're going there for the opening. It's going to be wicked. What a glorious day. So nice. Right. What up? Come on. Let's do it. Norwich, here we come. Good drive this morning, taking us just under about three hours. And now we've arrived at CrossFit Footpath with the crew. It's pretty cool. My back from all the rowing yesterday and my abs from all those GHDs. Sitting in a car for like three hours probably wasn't the best idea. Yeah, let's go in and have a look. My man, how the devil are you? Thank you so, so much for coming down. So this is CrossFit Spitfire. Look, it has like the Hulk on the wall. I don't know who that is, but that is like a Disney or Marvel character. And like, it's kind of like the Avengers. Like, the wall ball targets are my favorite part, look. You have like a Mickey Mouse and then the Captain America shield. How cool is that? Headband is on, that means one thing and one thing only, it's time to train. Dave has just finished putting the workout on the board and it's 10 rounds for time with a 40 minute time cap, but we're doing it in pairs, so it should be pretty fun. Five strict pull-ups, six power snatch, 12 burpees, 24 over box jumps, and then 48 double unders. For me, pairs workouts are like the, the fun things, the things where you get to work out with your friends and just kick ass. Today, I'm, today my pair is jazz. I don't even know who jazz is. One round left. Jazz did so well though. You know what? what? I think she loves working out with me, but hates it. Because <laughs> I get really moody, and I'm very sorry, Jazz, for getting really moody at you. I just always want to go as fast as possible. I'm like, come on! And she's like, no! She, uh, but then she does really well. <laughs> Box number 20. Appreciate that. Cheers, dude. Buddy, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you. Bye, guys. See you. See you. Now it's time to just head off and I think we're going to go to the coast. Ready? Ooh. We made it to the seaside. Any chance we get to go to the coast? Because we're like... Midlands where we live is literally like right in the center of England so it's like miles drive to either coastline so it was only like half an hour from Norwich where we were so we were like we have to go to the coast so nice I need to take these shoes off <laughs> Jasmine spotted a seal. Oh. I can come. 
confirm the seat is so cold. We uh, put in the postcode, hoping that it'd be like a coastal town or something. Ended up just being a beach. And I was we're, like, we're, I'm so hungry. I was just looking forward to some like fish and chips. Some like real seaside fish and chips. Look, the sky, the sea looks so bright compared to it. What's going on? There's some crazy ass storm over there. Compared to over there. We survived a storm, we found a fish and chip shop and I think I just consumed my body weight in fish and chips. Now we have a three hour drive home, I'm probably going to go into a food coma. It's been an absolutely awesome day though. Oh, I'm so full. <laughs> Team, we'll see you at home. Get to me, Alan, man. What do you eat them? Go and then hold me. Hold me, can you do me or do not do not? It's now gone quarter past eleven. We made it home safe and sound. The drive home was actually pretty good. I didn't realize that Spotify did um, comedy. Is that what you call it? Yeah, funny stuff that you laugh at as comedy. <laughs> it made the way home way more entertaining. That's like watching the telly, but without the visuals. Tomorrow is a rest day and we literally have nothing planned. Anyway guys. We'll catch you in the next one.